Hey, what's up guys? This is Nightwing2303 from WearTesters.com. Welcome back to Nightwing Knows. If you ever wanted to drop me a line, all you gotta do is shoot me an email right over here. So let's get right into the question. While we're eating. All right, so this is a two-part question from Connor. When was the first time you started seriously collecting shoes and what made you want to start a successful YouTube channel? Go over the YouTube channel first. You don't start one thinking it's going to be successful. That was a complete accident. And even then, I only have around, I think, maybe 200, almost at 200,000 subscribers. And that's not, in my mind, what I'd consider successful. If you've got a million subs no. and up, your money. What made me want to start a YouTube channel though? I really don't know. I must have been f***ing crazy. I never intended to show my face though. I always wanted to keep it just about the shoes. But, you know, one thing leads to another and then all of a sudden you're seeing this ugly mug on camera. As far as seriously collecting shoes, I don't consider what I do collecting. I almost consider it hoarding. But I don't buy shoes and I never have with the sole purpose of having like a, a collection or something like that. I just kind of bought what I wanted. And how it started back in high school was just that I'd always try to keep my shoes nice and clean because you didn't get that many when you were a kid, especially if you were working for everything that you got like I was by the time I was in high school. And so with that, I'd buy a pair of shoes once a year or whatever it might be. If I could find a deal here or there, I'd grab those too, as long as I had the funds, of course. And I would try to keep that pair as nice as possible. And then when it came time to being able to afford a second second pair, this pair was still pretty good. So all of a sudden I'd have two pairs of sneakers. I'd have what you call a rotation. And that just kind of kept happening. So, you know, basically I would just keep buying new shoes. I'd have my old shoes still. They still fit. My foot didn't grow luckily. And so I've just started accumulating shoes, but not quite collecting shoes. Collecting is when you kind of display something. This could be considered a display. I understand that completely, but this is actually more of storage for me. This keeps my shoes off the floor. And this is what I wear on, all, you know, on a daily basis. I go through all of these shoes all the time. I'll come home from work and I'll switch out shoes so I can wear another pair and whatever because I want to just kind of keep what I have that I actually rotate through and that's about it. I've gotten rid of everything else because it was just too much stuff. I didn't need it all. Way too many shoes for one person in one lifetime and it was just a little ridiculous. So everything that you see behind me, that's all I got left. If I grab a new pair, I have to pick a pair behind me to swap out for it, which isn't really a collection. A collection is you keep kind of accumulating stuff. Hopefully that all makes sense because I might have just confused myself. 